Good day everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. On this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix in case if there is no sound in Microsoft Edge. Now, the first step, what you will have to do is you will have to check the advanced sound option. Now, you will have to open Microsoft Edge and you will make sure there is a media playing in a Microsoft Edge. In my case, I have opened Microsoft Edge and playing one of the videos. Uh, so you can also do the same thing. Now, once it is done, you don't have to close this window. You can go ahead and keep this window minimized. Well, once this is done, you will have to click on the search. In the search, you will have to go ahead and type mmsys.cpl and you will have to open the sound properties or sound options window. So this will open the sound option. Now under this, uh, you will have to click on the playback tab. Now, in case if you have multiple output devices here, you will have to make sure there is an appropriate output device selected as a default. In my case, I have two different devices here. Now I have set the second one as a default. So I'm not seeing that option set as a default. As an example, uh, if I do a right click on the one of the output device, I would see an option as set as default device so same thing would happen in case if there is no default device you will have to do a right click and then click on set as default now once it is done uh, the next step what you will have to do is um, in addition to it you will have to click on the start button right click on the start button and then click on settings once you're on the settings page you will have to navigate to sound once you're on the sound, you will see a sound option on the right hand side. Click on sound and you will have to scroll down to the extreme bottom. Now here you will have to look for the option which says volume and mixer. Now here you will have to, you can go ahead and expand uh, the Microsoft Edge because that's the device or that's the browser where you're, not, where you're not able to play the sound. So you can expand the browser and make sure your output device has been set as a default. In my case, I had set my internal speakers as a default. So make sure this has been set as a default and also for the input and output. So just in case if you're facing a problem. In my case, um, since I had set output device as a default, it is going to select default. In case if you're not able to hear the sound, you choose the output device as a default here. So select the output device which is so input device would be the microphone here uh yeah it's the same as uh, the output device uh this is the internal speakers so once it is done uh, what you can do is uh, this these are the option and in addition to it as you try this step also make sure your in-app sound volume is not been muted so in case if it is muted you will not be able to hear the sound when it is playing from the microsoft edge so you will have to go ahead and unmute the app sound and make sure there is an appropriate level set for that particular app when the audio has been played from the microsoft edge so in my case i have set as a default so you can choose any level of your choice so this is how we, these are the settings what you need to do and once it is done you can try playing an audio from your Microsoft Edge and see if it works. In case if it works well and good, you don't have to try the next step. Now, as a next step, uh, what you will have to do is uh, you will have to open the sound properties again by clicking on the search and type mmsys.cpl. Open the sound properties. Now, under playback option, uh, you will have to do a right click on the default output device and then click on properties. Once you're on the properties, you will have to click on advanced. Under advanced, make sure these exclusive mode options are unchecked. So allow application to take inclusive control of the uh, of this device. Make sure it is unchecked. In case uh, these two options needs to be unchecked. In case by default these options will be unchecked. In case if it doesn't, make sure go ahead and uncheck these options. Once it is done, you can click on apply and then click on OK and then try to play um, an audio from Microsoft Edge and this should definitely fix a problem. In case if you're still facing a problem in spite of trying all these steps, what I would suggest you is to leave me a comment in the comment section so that I can come up with a possible solution. I hope this video was useful in case if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Have a great day.